Uh, the TAs and I have gotten several different questions on homework four, and since I'm unable to be in class today, I thought I'd, I'd take this opportunity to go through exactly what uh, we expect and make sure everyone understands and we're all on the same page. So first of all, there are three problems with the homework. Problem one, you're going to implement the pairwise interchange, the random pairs pairwise interchange uh, heuristic in particular. So you're going to have to develop this, this program uh, based on the pseudocode that we went over in class. The second problem, you will generate 10 random problems using my code, the random LAP code. And I give you the specific task size um, uh, that you want. I want you to have 200 tasks, and then there's a minimum and maximum task time, and you can select those to be whatever you'd like to do. Then basically what we're going to do is we're going to compare, compare the results of executing the LAPH2 code, which was the random sequence code that I gave you, with your code from problem one, which is the uh, random pairs pairwise interchange code, and the optimal solution from LAP optimal. So basically, you're going to create 10 random problems, and you're going to solve those problems using three different scripts. You're going to have your script or your program that was developed for problem one. You have mine that was developed or that I provided, LAPH2, and then you have my optimal solution which uses Garobi. And so you're going to execute these all separately and then create a word table that compares the results. And so I give you the specific format of the word table here. The table needs to have a header row and uh, so you're going to have 11 total rows, one header row plus 10 rows for each of the problems. And then each uh, row should include the problem number 1 to 10, the min and max values that you selected, so you chose these when you created the random test problems, the LAPHT solution, LAPH2 solution, again this is my code, uh, then the random pairs pairwise interchange solution, this is your code that was developed for problem 1, and the optimal solution, uh, which again will use my code. And finally, for problem three, I say discuss the results. And so in particular, discuss performance of the heuristics. We know that LAP optimal gives us the true optimal solution. And so if we have solutions that are better uh, than the LAP optimal, then we, that in, that's an indication that we have a problem somewhere because there's nothing better than the true optimal in this case. So I want you to just look at the elements of the table and then sort of discuss the relative uh, performance. Finally, what you need to turn into me, uh, what we're looking for here are the 10 test problems, and I gave you the specific names for those, and then I want your code that you developed for, the, for problem one, and then your document where you have the table, uh, and then the discussion. Also note, you can do this in groups of up to size three. You need all of the team members to submit the exact same zip file. And again, make sure that you follow all of the instructions, instructions in terms of naming files and everything because there's a lot of submission uh, for this homework.